in this video we are showing you full thickness horizontal corneal tear repair without peribulbar or retrobulbar block just with the help of one lint little canthal facial block and under the topical anesthesia we are repairing this para central horizontal wound with the 10 0 nylon suture you can see the globe movements due to fear of uh, extrusion of the intracular contents we did not give the peribulbar or retrobulbar block so now you can see we are passing the needle by going through partial thickness cornea so sometimes you have to repair the full thickness corneal tear on the topical in order to avoid the damage to the intraocular contents and if the patient is cooperative otherwise the best anesthesia for ocular trauma is general anesthesia so here we are applying three interrupted sutures that will seal the wound then the good thing is that the iris and lens they are safe anterior chamber is bit shallow so now we are we are applying the last the third stitch the third vertical stitch on the paracentral horizontal wound along the three o'clock you can see the globe movements you can also repair such wounds with one lint technique of facial blocks make sure after suturing the wound that you bury all the stitches like here we are doing it with a plain forcep or macpherson's close follow-up post-op and antibiotic plus dried ointments are given Thank you very much.